last game, but you know, two games in a row, you guys, your, your trio of posts have faced what people say are future NBA centers. Tell me about that challenge and how you guys approached it. Uh, we always uh, challenge it as if we need to go out and defend and try to hold whoever, you know, people get the status of NBA, whatever, which is good. Uh, we try to hold them to less than their average. And, uh, Thank God we've done that the last two games. Pretty exciting as a competitor to face those kind of guys. Though, oh, yeah, it is exciting because you got people who step on the court and all of the attention is on them, and then you get to go up against them because when you're in this game, you want to play against the best. So that's, that's what's good. Two games, you guys have faced two future NBA centers, kind of that trio down in the post starting to form up. What's that challenge been like the last two games facing those two guys, Zimmerman and then Podol, obviously? Um... For us, it's just more of a make it a better game for us and make sure we help our team. We know coming into the game, they're um, elite, and so we just try to, like, as much as possible. We work, we work on it in practice and push each other every day, so we we know we got to guard, like, good post players, really good, so we're we, uh, we able to um, stop them and just rotating three people in and out. You give them a lot, a lot of different looks, different body types. Um, get us knocking down a little bit in the post, you know, and make sure they don't get easy catches. That's that's the key uh, emphasis. As a competitor, pretty exciting to face those guys back to back, though, right? Yeah, I, I love it. I I I I prefer to face uh, any NBA center every every game. That's a good challenge.